episode is supported by Skillshare. You guys, I got to interview and make a really smart and accomplished person answer physics riddles while I sat there smugly knowing all the answers. Ah! Hi, I'm Diana. You're watching Physics Girl, Silicon Valley edition. And I'm joined by Ann Wojcicki, CEO and co-founder of 23andMe. Thank you so much totally. for so being fun. honest. I like, I'm gonna play it cool for this video, uh -huh. but like you're one of my heroes. <laughs> well, we love you. Oh. You know my kids love you. You are, you have officially been declared to be cooler than Santa. I don't think like my ego is ready for that. <laughs> Can you tell me what you do at 23andMe in 23 seconds or less? Yes. We enable people to get access to their genetic information and to learn about themselves. That was much less than 23 uh, seconds. So I can keep going. <laughs> so we explore you your health yeah. and your ancestry yeah. through your DNA. Like I look at you and I can learn all these things about just looking at you, mm -hmm. but it's the same thing. Like your your DNA is your digital code. Did you always like science where you as a sciencey person? I always liked exploring the world and always loved kind of understanding what was yeah. around. Um, That's what physicists do too. Like they, they're think curious people. There's nothing more exciting to me than that moment when you get a result of an experiment. Mm -hmm. Like I love those days when I walk into the lab and like you get a result. And you know, in some ways like children are kind of like a result of an experiment. Like every day it's interesting <laughs> <laughs> to see what experiment my children I'm do. I'm not ready to undertake yet. <laughs> but then see what they do. And like, and that's part of the beauty for me with genetics is yeah. that you're constantly learning about like and what does the genome mean for you? Do you think of your children as a genetic experiment? Oh, we call them that. <laughs> yeah, Amazing. We, we really own it. So we were like, no, 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 my two little genetic experiments. That is fantastic. <clears throat> now, <laughs> it is time for the riddles. Okay, good. Are you wait. ready? I can't wait. Let's okay. hear. The whole reason that I that I have you here is mm -hmm. to torture you with. Oh god, I can't wait. <laughs> so curious. With the riddles. You have to be gentle on me. Yes. This is gonna be fun for me. Oh good. And I'll I'll give you the opportunity to ask me a riddle just okay. to make the playing cool. field a little more fair. Okay. So the first one's a bit of a warm up. So it goes like this. There's an adventurer somewhere on Earth. Oh, the globe. Wow. Yeah. So there's an adventurer, a, okay. an explorer somewhere on the globe. Okay. This adventurer, she walks um, a mile south, and then she walks a mile east. A mile. And then a mile north. Okay. Mile south a mile east and then a mile north. And she ends up in the exact same place. Where oh. on earth is she? Pause here if you want to think about the answer before we go on. So you've never heard this? No. Perfect. Um, okay, I have to get serious. Okay, wait, wait, yeah. wait. So, but she's but it's just directly south a mile? Directly south a mile, going south or along south, the yeah. longitude lines. Oh, so she along. starts at, so she's got to start down here and she's going to go south. We can't, East. this is the South Pole. Okay. So she can't go south from there. We'll add that rule oh, to the riddle. Gosh. All right. <laughs> um, okay, north. Okay, <laughs> go on. So she's at the North Pole. She's walking south and she goes east and then she goes north. Beautiful. Oh, I did it. Yeah, that was amazing. I feel so good. That was beautiful. I'm so yeah. proud of myself. That's the warm up. Okay. Let's not get okay. ahead of ourselves. <laughs> but, okay. Okay, I feel <laughs> feeling pretty good. Good, good. Okay. Um, so. Okay. This is this is like a, a pretty common riddle if you've heard these, but there's another answer. Oh. Yeah. Okay. What can you think okay, of what the another other one? answer is? Yeah, it's not and the it, North Pole. No longer. And cut! Come back tomorrow for the answer. I know you hate waiting. You hate it almost as much as you hate being told what to do, so I would never do that. I would merely suggest that you think about the answer and post your thoughts in the comments and like this video. Bah! Just come back tomorrow to get the answer to this riddle and to get the next riddle. Bye! <laughs> I'd like to thank Skillshare for sponsoring this episode. Skillshare is an online learning community with classes in design, business, photography, and more. Premium membership includes unlimited access to thousands of classes and is available starting at $10 a month. And you'll be able to learn from anywhere by downloading the Android or iPhone app. Maybe you want to learn how to mix music to make that physics song that you've wanted to put on YouTube. To get a two month free trial and help support our show, click the link in the description or go to Skillshare.com and use promo code physicsgirl during checkout. <laughs>